welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for the video today. We're going to be getting into some items that I picked up from the new Studio McGee collab with Threshold, launching September 13th at Target. So keep on watching and we'll get into the video. So I've been so, so excited for this collab. As soon as I found out that it was coming out and that they were doing a second collection with Threshold, I was just so stoked and I had to go and see what I could find at my local Target because it's not launching until September 13th online, but they're slowly trickling in to the Target stores. Um, so you can go and check out your local Target and see what you can pick up. Um, I just picked up a couple of the items that I really liked and thought would go well in my home. Um, I didn't really get too many of the big furniture items that they're launching, but they are so, so beautiful, and I really encourage you guys to go check it out. Um, I'll leave the whole collection that they're launching, a link to that in the description box below. Um, but I just picked up a couple items that I thought would work well in my home that were just a little bit of extra Studio McGee flair here and there, because I just love their collection so much. I love everything that they style. Um, it just looks so fresh and modern, but not too, too modern. It's still cozy, and I just, that is my vibe. I love the cozy and the warm because I'm in my home a lot, especially now that we're all in quarantine um, and spending a lot of time at home. I really am wanting my home to be cozy. So a lot of these items are things that are going to be making my home just feel more cozy and um, getting ready to go into this fall season as well. So I shared this pillow in my last fall decor video, um, but I thought I would throw it in here again because this is from, um, from the Studio Mickey collection. Um, and I just, I really love this pillow. It's so, so squishy. My husband loves this pillow. He has a thing where it's like, if the pillow is going to be on our couch, then it has to be comfortable. Otherwise, he's a no-go, which I'm already pushing the boundaries because I've got like a little leather accent pillow on the couch. So, can't, can't push him too far. So, this one is so nice and cozy and has this really nice detail with the leather um, accent. So, this is definitely one that I would encourage you guys to pick up. They also have it in a taupe, and I just saw they have it in a rust color as well. Um, and it comes in this big 22 by 22 square, and they also have it in a lumbar size as well in all three colors. So definitely encourage you guys to pick that up. I also picked up a couple more pillows. This one is the oversized lumbar. And I saw it online and I really, really liked it. So I was really excited to see that it was in my local Target. I thought it would look really good um, on my bed that I have. Um, so yeah, it's actually, it's really beautiful, don't get me wrong. But the one thing I will say is it is not super comfortable because it has a lot of texture. So. I don't know if you guys can see, but it just has, it's textured, so it's more of a rougher material, so definitely not one that you would want to be lounging on or cuddled up with, um, but if, for me, just throwing it on my bed, like, it's not going to be a big deal if it feels like this, because we take our pillows off our bed to go to sleep, so... Um, it's not a big deal, but it still looks really beautiful. It adds some texture and dimension to um, my bed, which I'll show you guys. But, um, yeah, I just thought it was a really nice addition to my bed. I also picked up this one, which I really want to get another one because um, I have two leather chairs in my living room that I really wanted to put this lumbar pillow on, so I need another one. I only had one in stock um, at my local Target, so um, I'm definitely going to be trying to order another one. Pillows are one thing that um, Studio McGee is really known for, are just their textiles in general. Um, so I really felt like I was getting like a little taste of Studio McGee um, into my home without 
having to buy the more pricey furniture pieces, which I don't really have space for right now anyways. Um, but this still gives you a little bit of Studio McGee in your home as well. And it has this um, rusty accent, so great for fall. Um, and just thought it would pair really well with the leather chairs that I have in my living room currently. I also picked up this throw blanket, which is the eyelet throw blanket. And it was only $30, $35. Um, but I loved this rusty color and thought it would just add a, a lot of color and texture um, to my couch because usually I just have really neutral colored um, throws on my on my sofas but thought that this one would add a lot of texture and it's got this knit eyelet fabric and it's just it's very soft it's um kind of a similar feel to the faux fur pillow that I showed you guys earlier um but this is a really nice color to add in to your fall decor um it also comes in a cream and a beige as well Next, I picked up this large vase, which was $25, and it's very similar to um, one that they launched in their previous collection with Threshold, um, but that one was more of a cream gray tone, and this is a more darker fall gray tone, um, and it's actually a little bit larger as well, um, as opposed to the, the one that they previously launched, but... I just thought this this was really beautiful, and I always can find a place for a vase in my home just to add um, texture and color. Even if you don't even put anything in it, it still looks really beautiful just on its own. So I went ahead and picked this up. And then I also, also picked up this bowl, this wooden bowl. It's all be so beautiful just styled anywhere in your home on any bookshelf or console table that you have um just thought it would be a really beautiful addition and it has just this really nice light colored wood which i really like um so my home doesn't get a ton of natural light so i try and keep the wood tones that i use in my house pretty um pretty light so that it's not like darkening up my space any more than it already is so i thought this would be really beautiful just styled on a shelf um and yeah i really like it i think it's really nice and neutral okay so picked up this lamp and i really really like it i saw it online and thought that it would look really pretty on a console table that i have the lamp that i currently have on there is a little bit too small and this one is just so large in scale um so i thought it would be really really good on that console which i'll show you guys um but it's got this wood detail like almost um like a gray washed wood um with carving detail in it and this was only fifty dollars for a lamp which like a lamp with a shade and it's by studio mcgee like yes they are known for their lighting like lighting textiles just so beautiful um, but I really liked this one, um, and for $50, it's a, a really great price. They also have, um, a lot of other lighting coming out in their collection, which I would definitely encourage you guys to go and check out. This next item is a larger item, um, but I saw it, and I really, really liked it. But I didn't get it at first, and then I went back, and it was still there, and so I grabbed it because I just really, really love this. It's $99, which is really not that bad for an ottoman like this, um, and the lid comes off, so that's really awesome, a storage ottoman, um, but... I actually thought that this would be really good um, over by my door because we always take off our shoes when we come in the house. And so I thought this would be a really good way to store them um, and then not just clutter up 
the space by the door. So definitely going to be using this there. Um, you could also style this with some blankets. Um, if you just wanted to take the lid off, you could use it without the lid. Um, styled in a corner with some cozy blankets for fall and winter this year. Um, or you could also, I feel like it's really sturdy. <laughs> like this is a pretty heavy piece. So I feel like you could even um, get two of these and style them in front of your fireplace for additional seating. Um, I feel like you could definitely sit on this guy. It's pr pretty sturdy and pretty heavy, like I said. Um, but they also have a couple other ottomans that are coming out in their collection um, that are fabric. Um, so definitely look into those as well. Um, but those are not storage ottomans. Those are just ottomans that you can style, sit on. Um, but this one is really nice because you have that additional storage with it. So it's very functional as well. I also picked up a print from them called the Foggy Oceanside Trees print, which I'll put a picture of right here. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to be keeping it or not just because... When I saw it in store, I thought it was great. I brought it home, but the more that I looked at it, it almost just looks like it's not the best quality of picture. Like it almost looks kind of grainy, which I don't know maybe if that's what they're going for in the picture with the fogginess um, or what, but I'm gonna style it in my space and see if the graininess of the picture is really visible. Um, if it's not, I may just keep it and see how it looks, but um, that's just something that you guys may want to keep in mind whenever you're thinking about purchasing that print um, in particular. But the other ones that I've seen, they didn't have that graininess to them. So um, it may just be this specific print, but the other ones that I saw were not, they didn't have that same graininess to them. So just keep that in mind whenever you are thinking about purchasing this print in particular. That's all I have for you guys today. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you can get your hands on some of this Studio McGee collab with Threshold launching September 13th. If you guys like these kinds of videos, please hit the subscribe button. Um, I make new videos like this every single week on home decor, DIY home decor, and just making your home look upscale on a budget. So if you guys like that kind of content, hit the thumbs up button. I can't wait to make more videos for you guys. See you later.